right, everybody. So it looks like Chaos Sonic has arrived to Sonic Speed Simulator. There's some other skins as well. So make sure to subscribe to the channel with all notifications. I'll give you a second. And I don't know what else. Like the video. Just, just do something. All right, here we go. Let's check out the new update if my computer, my if my connection ever uh, works out. All right, so what do we got here? Sonic Cup, I'm a huge fan. Thank you, bro. Thank you so much for being a fan. We appreciate all you guys. All right. So, here we go. Sonic Prime update. So, if you look. So, we have to complete the quest in order to earn Black Rose. Complete them all for No Place Sonic. So, Black Rose and No Place Sonic are available. All right. I was able to unpause my internet. And here we go. So, guys. Chaos Sonic. Chaos Sonic. He is a skin. And I got to say, he's a very impressive looking skin. For sure. Like, his design is, is really awesome. Like, I feel like at first I didn't like it. But, I mean, from behind he looks like Metal Sonic. But, yeah. There's Chaos Sonic super annoying he was like one of the most annoying characters ever in the show and then we have no place sonic you see his little uh you see his thing and then we got black rose so let's see if we have to do these in order oh we just have to collect doubloons oh that's so easy we have to collect doubloons to get him so i mean you could literally watch the video we did yesterday to unlock him um complete quest in order to earn black rose all right First thing we have to do is collect sky rings. A hundred sky rings. So our first objective, sorry for the lag, is to do a hundred sky hoops again. I think New York City's are... I'm torn because, like, you know, you got some in no place. And the theory is, you know, if you're in no place, you could collect the blooms and stuff like that. Um, you could also collect them in Green Hill and other places. So honestly, now that I think about it, now that I've had some time to actually think about it... You could, you could do it in no place if you want, if you think that's fast. But I truly think the fastest way to do the experience hoops portion of the quest is to go straight to New York City. I think it's just, I think it's just slightly faster. All right, so yeah, like I said before, New York City is a really good place to do it. And you got to go up here. Look how many you're going to get in just such an easy and clear defined path. That's what, that's what I like about this. I like the fact that we don't have to, uh, look, we don't really have to do much. We just kind of go in a straight line. You can almost do this with one hand. Look at that. You see how many we're getting? Oh, we're picking up a little too much speed. Oh, I fell. Okay, see? I try I try to be clever. I try to be funny. And uh didn't end up working out for me. So yeah, for the uh for the hoop portion though, again, these these up I don't know what to call this. Upper levels, upper layers, whatever you want to call it, is in my opinion, the fastest way to get these. You're also by the way, I'm collecting the blooms up here, so um for those of you wondering if it's uh no place or New York City. You get the blooms up here as well. So it actually doesn't matter. Of course, you'll get more in no place from, you know, that's my, from my understanding from what the devs have said, but New York city is your place to go for the, uh, for the hoops. So look at that. There's three in a row right here. You're not going to really find that many that quickly. You know, it's, it's, it's kind of difficult to do. So, um, let's go here. Look at that. Boom. Four, five. Like it's incredible. Oh, we'll come down here. Look at that. There's so many to get. We're, we're already at 38. So you guys get the gist. All right. So we were able to get 100. Now, next we have to do is destroy the egg forcers. Now, again, they have them in no place, but I do truly think that this, that New York City is a really viable option for this. I'm going to, I'm going to keep you guys posted and see how many doubloons I get while I do this. I, I, I truthfully don't, I don't know if it really matters. We can go map out uh, no place, but obviously, you know, that egg forcers have pretty high spawn rates in New York city. So it's, it's really not that difficult to get them. Look at that. Boom. We're going crazy right now. There's also doubloons here too. So you're going to be able to do a little bit of everything over here. I would like to check out no place real quick to give you guys an answer though. If it's like, if they're, if it's viable, because no place is viable for doubloons. Like, Absolutely. So, let's see what we got, man. Oh, I just found out. It's not even the little robots. It has to be specifically the egg forcers. These ones. It's not the little ones. It's the big ones. All right, so we're back in no place. And there's a lot of egg forcers in here. So, the egg forcers, it's not the little ones you want to go for. It's actually the big guys. A good thing to do, actually, is hop on the Marvelous Queen if you have it from the racing shop. Um, and it looks like this actually might be the spot. Because there's, there's a nice grouping of them. And they're a little bit easier to spot in this zone because it's a little bit more open. So actually, you know, I was in New York City and it's not bad over there. Like there's still the blooms and stuff like that. But if you're on the Marvelous Queen, you can shoot the oxygen. So you never worry about that. Or you could also play as a different character if you want. Yeah, you see him right here. 
see a couple over here yeah we're shooting uh we're shooting the oxygen bubbles because i don't want to play as a robot i'm not playing as no robot character but yeah i mean this is also a good spot you know you got a little pocket right there it's, it's a pretty long event i will say it's it's not easy look at that we got some over there like i would say new york city is just as good if not better but also the difference is definitely negligible it's definitely uh it's definitely pretty close if you don't have a, a flying underwater mount then i would recommend probably going to new york city if you have an underwater flying mount i would say maybe no place i mean it really depends on where you want to go Lots of doubloons here to pick up as well. And it's just like the visibility is a little bit better over here. Like you see, you, you, you kind of see everything more, if that makes sense. So that's what we're going to do for this objective. And uh, let's let's see what the next one is. It's just important to remember that you stay low in this zone. You're going to collect the doubloons. I think we're going to unlock Chaos Sonic before we get the other characters. All right, we did the quest. So yeah, we, I mean, I basically stuck around no place in the Marvelous Queen. And, and the next objective is to pop air bubbles. Wow. All right, so you have to be in no place for this. Now... If you have Marvelous Queen, this is going to be the fastest way to do it. There's really no other fast way to do it. Like, you, you know, you got to you gotta unlock everything, man. You got to, when, when the race shop updates and there's new mounts and stuff, you got to buy them, all right? I don't know if any other air mounts work um, underwater, but shooting the air bubbles, and this is probably harder than the egg forcers too, because we've only popped 14. Oh, we just got a super chat. What's your favorite version of Tales and Sonic Prime? It is nine for sure. I think nine's got the best character arc for sure. like he's literally an alternate. He's he's not like his character is not too alternate. It's literally just Tales if you never met Sonic, basically. And it, it, it's it's it, he has the best character development for sure. Like he's definitely my favorite. Thank you for the super chat, by the way. Um, Marvelous Queen, yeah, this is this is the way to go. So to pop air bubbles, man. I mean, if you don't have a tornado, your best the mounts aren't even really that good for it either mounts are are fast for travel um underwater you can traverse really fast it's even faster than supersonic dare i say but the precision's not really there so if you don't have the marvelous queen this is going to be tough um there's really no way around it it's it's kind of tough to pop these air bubbles. We got 26 out of 300. Yeah, like kind of tough. You're going to want to look around the map with this marvelous queen. You're going to want to shoot stuff down and you have a really good flexible range of motion. You're in a range of shots or I don't even know what to call it. Shot range. You know, you, you can be in a lot of different places at once with this because you have uh, the shooters, you know? So look at that. We're, we're taking out a bunch over here. If you got to do this on foot, this, this is going to take you a little bit, but stay low, collect the blooms, and you're going to have Chaos Sonic along the way, like easily for sure. This guy's name is Ray the Flying Squirrel. He says, can I have a shout out? And he has the Ray the Flying Squirrel outfit. That's kind of lit. I kind of I kind of like that. I feel like you don't really see too many people making other characters, little UGC cosplay, whatever the, whatever the hell you want to call it. All right, anyways, all right, back to the mission. All right, we're about to pop another bubble, and boom, pop that bubble. What do we got? I think we just unlocked uh, Amy Rose Pirate. There she is, guys. We got Black Rose right here. Here is how the skin looks. Very cool. This is this is honestly uh, one of the better characters in Sonic Prime. If you didn't watch my Sonic Prime tier list ranking, I actually ranked her... Um, I think I, I ranked her in the A tier of characters. So here she is, guys. Here she is in action. Let's give her a little... Give her a little jump, a little spin dash. Yeah, very cool. Very cool skin. If you like Sonic Prime, you'll definitely like this skin. Now, what is the next quest? The next quest is to find hidden treasure. Mmm. All right, so now we have to find treasure chests. Now, while I'm testing, it should be fixed. I don't know if it's fixed. I, we'll have to see. All right, there's some over here. Boom. So just pay attention, guys. You got to get 50 of these. I actually really like doing... Um, like fixed scavenger hunts and what i mean by this is like when chests are like scavenger hunt pieces are in certain locations all right we got one right there you guys can just uh follow along real quick i know there's one right back here oh, i see one over here yeah the, the the ones where it's like a fixed location and you have to like look around the map to like find something like right here i don't know for some reason i really enjoy these uh these versions of scavenger oh, i'm about to drown i'm about to drown i wanted to show you guys the skin but now i'm about to drown all right we got some over here these are actually pretty pretty easy to find. Another one over here, boom. Um, there's I know there's some in the middle as well. So let's go let's go over to the middle while we're at it. I'm a little slow right now though. So I, honestly, for this one, I might hop on my hoverboard because you're really fast with the hoverboards. Um, you're not as precise, you know. what I'm saying sometimes you overshoot stuff, but you you move a lot quicker with extreme gear. So look at that. See, not as precise, but you move a lot quicker. So there's some in the middle. Apparently these respawn. So I don't know. I don't know how that's gonna work. Um, that, that, that's the intention at least. All right, we got another one over here. We're already at 15. There's another one right here. Boom. Another one right here. 
Boom. We're definitely. We're, we're, I think we're making it happen, chat. I think. I think we're making things. Oh, another one right here. Another one right here. Ready? Oh, see, I'm a lot quicker. But I just like I, I miss a lot. I miss. You know. Oh, there's one right here as well. There's one right here. You guys can literally just follow. You guys can just pause the video and just watch me do this as I go. If you're trying to be quick. All right, let's go into Tails Lab because I know that there's a chest right there. Oh, we found another one right here near the big loop-de-loop -loop in Green Hill. Okay, I see another one right here. Boom, we're already at 23. This is probably one of the better objectives. I actually quite enjoy, like I said before, doing this. We got one up here. Boom, another one. And we're getting red star rings along the way too. So if y'all need red star rings, you better be, uh, you better be doing this quest because they, they just planted them around the world, which is, uh, which is good. All right, there's one near the enchanting table. Of course, there's one over there and there's one right up here. Ready, boom, nice. Oh, I see one down in this area. Drop dash, got it. Nice, I think there should be another one hiding around here somewhere. I think like underneath, yeah, oh, there it is. Boom, then, yep, there's one right there too. Oh, there's two, there's two. One. And oh, I'm gonna drown, I'm gonna drown. Oh my God, I drowned right in front of one. All right, we found another one near, where is this? This is near the second loop-de-loop, -loop, near the second OG loop-de-loop. -loop. But then I also saw one right here. That's the one I missed before. Or did I get it? No, I didn't get it. That, there it is, all right, boom, one. Whenever there's one, there's usually another not too far off. Look at that, boom, three. And by the way, make sure you're hitting this spot over here for doubloons. This is like my doubloon go-to spot. Cause we gotta get a lot, man. My, my doubloons got reset, which I was pretty upset about. All right, there's one right here near Tails Workshop and boom, got it. One down here, of course. You gotta just go to the places you haven't explored. Boom, pretty self-explanatory with respect to that. Another one right here near the big loop-de-loop -loop in Green Hill. Another one, boom, that's 38. Hope you guys are paying attention. Oh, I see one right here, boom, near the uh, big loop-de-loop -loop in Green Hill. Hmm, I, I don't think they do actually. Okay, there's one right here. I don't know. You guys tell me. I think it's supposed to. That's what the devs wanted it to do, but stay stay tuned on that. That's why you're going to need to see all, all the treasure chest locations here. Because, yeah, it looks like I just joined a new server and they're not done yet. So, all right. Make sure you guys are paying attention. Pause in the video as you go. Uh, we got another one right here. Boom. We're at 43. And I'm about to drown. I'm literally about to drown. I don't want to play as a robot. If I get Chaos Sonic, I'll play as a robot. Other than that, I'm not a robot. All right. I'm a... I'm a oh, found one right here next to spawn. Boom. Nice. I don't know if my game's lagging or not, but I just found one right there. Oh, is there another one right here? Ready? Boom. Got it. There we go. Oh, yeah, we're cooking right now. All right, here we go. I got another chest right here. Boom. 46. That's 46 chests, people. That's 46. We're so close, but kind of far away. Oh, there's another one right there. Boom. 47. All right, found another one right here near the enchanting table area in Green Hill. Right up on this nice little perch right here. Oh, is there another chest right there? How is there a spring here, but not a chest? That's crazy. There should be a chest there. I, I, I just made that up. There should be one though. All right, we found another one right here. Boom. And is there any more? I think I see one up here. We're at 49. We're literally one more away. And remember, I like being on the board for speed. If you, if you want to go fast in the water, the extreme gear is basically your best bet. If you have the dread pirate ship, which you probably should at this point, that's going to be the way to do it. We just need one more, man. One more. There we go. I found the last one. I found the last one right here. Right here near the workshop. Boom. Now we have one last quest, and that is to collect 5,000 chaos orbs. Bro, that is dumb easy. That is dumb easy. They made it nice and easy for me. Who would have thought they were going to make it easy for me? Look at that. And this actually works for the event shell. See, I'm not going to waste time. I'm just going to go straight to Green Hill because look at that. With my event shell, I'm smoking this event right now. Look at that. So easy. I'm, I'm not trying to go back and forth running underwater. Although, I mean, I guess you could do on the hoverboard. But I don't know. I just I just like running around for this type of event more. Um, like I said before, New York City is pretty good. But, I mean, with, with the rate that we're gaining these uh, chaos orbs, it really doesn't matter. Okay? It, it doesn't matter at all. So, we're going to keep grinding it out. And then we're going to unlock No Place Sonic. There we go. We did it, guys. We got Black Rose. We got No Place Sonic. Let's check out him. And then we're going to go ahead and show you guys Chaos Sonic next. Where is, uh, where is he? Where is he? I can't, oh, there he is. No play, Sonic, no play style. Hey. Look at that. There he is. There he is, guys. No play Sonic. Let's take a look at him. 
His 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 feet is his shoes are pretty drippy actually. I, I like I like what's going on underneath his shoes. Would you look at that? Ready? Boom. He's he's looking pretty drippy, guys. He's looking pretty he's looking pretty fresh, I will say. So let's go ahead and get Chaos Sonic and then uh let me know what you got which which out of these three skins is your favorite. So here he is, guys. No play Sonic. This is him in action. Is there anything else you want to see with him? And falling animation, boost animation. Pretty, pretty much your standard stuff. He runs like the regular Sonic. I guess we can reveal the big secret and what it does. Look at... Oh, oh. There we go. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Yes, he does. For those of you wondering, yes, he does. Yes, the devs absolutely cooked. And now, we gotta show you guys... We gotta show you guys the big boss. We gotta show you the big boss. Hey, My boy, Chaos Sonic. This skin... Yo, this might be my new... He's definitely MSDG for sure. He's Metal Sonic Drip Gang. Oh, oh look at his look at his running animation. Dude, it's so funny. It's so funny, bro. It's so goofy. I love it. I love it, actually. Look at him run. Oh, my God, dude. That's actually hilarious. Hold on, let's go to Green Hell with him real quick. Look at this guy. This is like the best look you'll get at Chaos Sonic because you don't really see... You know, you don't really get to examine him in the show as much. Dude, this guy... I want to see his boost... Oh, whoa! Yo, he flies in the, uh, that's funny. That's funny. Look at him go. It looks like the show, though. That's the thing. It actually does look very faithful to the show. The way, the way he starts up, though, is, is hilarious. <laughs> oh, my. The way he, he looks like he's just flailing his arms around. That's so, that's hilarious. Great update, man. Great series of updates. Uh, this is Chaos Sonic. Three skins in one update. A new world. They cooked for Sonic Prime. I gotta say, they definitely cooked pretty hard for Sonic Prime. That's the grind animation. Let's see how he looks on a hoverboard, because he is a brand new character. Let's see how he looks. Does he do any cool tricks? It looks like he does the same uh, Sonic tricks, but... Yeah, man, that's Chaos Sonic. Let me know what you guys think, and yeah.